Hey everyone, so recently I had an issue when I was trying to add some sound effects or some short audio clips to a video or a stream or whatever I was trying to do. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and make another scene here. Oops. And then add some media. So now already you can see that nothing came up in the audio mixer for for this sound. Um, I'm going to add two more just for the example. All right, so I got my three sounds. Still, none of them came up in the audio mixer. If I try to play them, nothing happens. Um, so the first thing you could try is see if you have anything hidden. So I actually, I did have a couple hidden. So we got monitor, desktop audio, um, and the Chrome window. None of that is what I'm looking for. So the next thing you could try out is the studio mode. So we'll switch that off. And we'll see that it switched my scene. All right, so if I hit studio mode, all of my all of my audio sources actually come up in the audio mixer. My screen is black now, so let me switch that. I'm gonna add that to my scene here, actually. Okay, so we're back here. All right, so as you can see in studio mode, now I do have all of my audio source is present in the mixer. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to studio mode. They should still be here. Yep. And I'm going to test them out. And still I we hear nothing from them. Ben so the next thing I'm going to do is check the preferences, the advanced the audio seat. properties here. And I'm going to change monitor off to monitor and output. So we'll do that for each of the sounds here. And personally, I don't want these tracks checked, so I'm gonna uncheck those. Okay, so now I should be able to hear all my sounds. We have been hoodwinked, bamboozled, led astray. Yep, perfect. All right, so everything, everything runs as needed. So now what I'm gonna do is I want to add that to another scene so I can try to use it as a soundboard. So first thing I'm going to do is highlight those and create a group with them. I'll call that group. I'll call that group sounds. And then we'll add that into the scene that I want. Okay, cool. So now I'm going to go ahead and set my hotkeys for that, for that soundboard. Now, since this is a Mac, it may not show up right away here. So we see them separately, but we want the group sounds. And yeah, it's not showing up here. So what I'll have to do for that is just quit the program and restart it. So I'll do that really quick and we'll be right back. All right, so I just restarted OBS. So now I will try to look for those hotkey options again. Let's go back to hotkeys and I should look for sounds, the sounds group. Let's see, let's see. And sounds is now available here. So I'm just gonna number these for for the uh, show and hide so that that, uh, that eyeball will open and close on these hotkeys. So I'll give a number to each. We're gonna apply and hit okay. So now they should work. Oops, click here. All right, so I'm not hearing anything. So let's click this and actually hit stop. And then let's try to use these again. We have been hoodwinked, bamboo. All right, so as you can see, you would need to 
do that one additional step if you do anything outside of the sounds, right? So, for example, if I go to this scene and come back, oops, I left it on, you see what happens. But if I go to a scene, come back, and I try to use my shortcut, it doesn't work. But if I hit stop and then use my shortcut, we have been hoodwinked. Or hotkey rather, then it'll work again. Oh, let me actually go back to studio mode. Um, but yeah, so now we have been hoodwinked. I can use my hotkeys as I want, and they work as I want it to. So if that was an issue for you, hopefully this helped you out. And if it did, let me know in the comments below. Or if you found even a better way to handle this, please let me know in the comments. And uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks.